Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me the greatest pleasure to pronounce the priestly blessing over my granddaughter and her new husband. Yevorechacha Adonai v'yishmorecho Ya'er Adonai pono ve'lecho v'chunecho Yeso Adonai pono ve'lecho v'yoseim lecho shalom May the Lord bless you and protect you. May the Lord make his face to shine on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord turn his countenance towards you and give you peace now and forevermore. Today, Abby, you look absolutely beautiful and you are shining like you have never shone before. As you know, your name means Father's joy and you bring me joy in all that you do. And today that has never been more true. Not only are you your father's joy, but also your mother's. And it is clear to see that above all, you are Ollie's joy. I'm sure most of you assume that today is by far the most important wedding that we've ever been to. You'd be right, but there is one that comes very close. Way back in 2018, I was a bridesmaid for my friend Chloe. As I sat down at the table for dinner, I turned to my left to see one of the ushers, the tall, slightly shy Mancunian one. <laughs> yes, it was Ollie, and of course, the rest is history. You two complement one another, and together you are so much better than you have been before. We give you the blessing that surrounded by family and friends, you will have a lifetime of happiness, of simcha together, and in good health, we all will be able to watch as you go forth on your beautiful journey as a married couple. Mazel tov to you both. Abby, you look absolutely beautiful tonight. I'm so excited to start the next chapter of our lives together. I can't put into words how I felt when I saw you at the Bedeckin and walking down the aisles of the Hopper. I feel so lucky to call you my wife. You're an amazing person and have such love for your friends and family. You work incredibly hard and show such dedication and passion for educating your students and I'm so proud of you for your recent promotion to Head of Year 7. You're the perfect woman for me and I can't wait to spend a lifetime together with you. I love you so much. Now, everybody that knows Ollie will know what an all-round sound and impressive man he is. And that aside from Abby, his biggest passions are Manchester City, numbers and sport. But who is the real Oliver Bailey? I mean, just look at him. I know it's his wedding, so you would expect his posture, hair and attire to be pretty on point. But even on an average weekday, Ollie never has a hair out of place and constantly exudes that suave Roger Federer type look of somebody who has never broken sweat in his life. We're so grateful that Ollie met you, Abby. You're one of the most genuine and warm people that we know, and we've all loved getting to know you over the past couple of years, and we look forward to spending more time together with you as a married couple.
Ollie, you really don't need us to tell you that today you have married the most amazing woman. You have fitted in so well into our family that I cannot even remember when we welcomed you in. Everyone who knows you and Abby knows how well you complement each other. There are the obvious aspects, you being quite tall and Abby being a little closer to the ground. And other factors not apparent at first sight, such as your calming nature being a reassuring foil to Abby's more excitable disposition. But you have also fit in so well with everyone else too. A willing PlayStation partner to Johnny and David, and a tolerant companion to me when it comes to discussions about double entry bookkeeping and spreadsheets. And we could not be more delighted to have you as our son-in-law. André Marois, the French Jewish author, said the following, A happy marriage is a long conversation which always seems too short. Abby and Ollie, may you always have wonderful conversations and may your conversations last forever. Ollie, you are truly my perfect match and we complement each other's flaws. Thank you for comforting me when I'm over emotional. Thank you for getting me the best deal on my car insurance when I'm too lazy to shop around. And thank you for changing the light bulbs. I promise I'll always get rid of the spiders when you're too scared. There are so many reasons why I love you. You're handsome, intelligent, and calm under pressure. You are the most selfless, thoughtful, and kind person to your friends, family, and to me. You make me feel comfortable to be 100% myself, and you have made me a happier and more confident person. You have never tried to change me, and I would never want to change you. In my eyes, you are completely perfect. I treasure every second with you, but I also cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you.